Hi friends, good morning everyone. Uh, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to update a specific field with a common value in Vendor Master. Let us go to the transaction code. You can use the transaction code called XK99. You can directly come here or else you can use the transaction code called MASS. M-A-S-S, once you come to this MASS maintenance, click on object type. Here, there is an object type called vendors. Click on LFA1, that vendors. It is given LFA1, but object name, but you will have all set of tables. So either you can come directly with XK99 transaction code, or you can come to mask tree code and select the object type LFA1. So let us take a field. Let me take a field in LFM1. Okay, LFM1, execute it. This method you can utilize the whatever approach I'm showing. Same value you want to replace for all the fields. You can utilize this option. Give the purchasing organization for which you wanted to change it. GKPO. If you want to change the respect to value for specific fields, you can, if you want to change the respect to value for specific vendors, then you can input the vendors. Otherwise, you can give your purchasing organization and click on execute it. Okay. So there are only two vendors are there. Now click on select fields. Which field you wanted to update? For example, you wanted to update purchasing group. Select that field and click on choose. Now click this button. So you want to update for mass. Let's give the purchasing group. You can click F4 or else if you know the field, you can input, for example, 001. Give the field and select the entire column. See, I selected the entire column. You can see this color change. And uh, there is a button called carry out a mass change. Click on carry out mass change. See, if you have a thousand vendors or 10 vendors or 20 vendors, system will update the purchase group for all those vendors. Now save it. This method is mainly useful for to replace single value for many vendors, okay? If you want to update with different, different values and all, then you can uh, use the upload method. You can search MM17 by Ganesh Padala. The similar approach you can follow for these videos also. In future, I will try to make one video for uh, upload for vendors also. The process will be more or less it is same. Okay, so system has updated like this and enter part two of uh, inco temps. I think for this vendor, there is another error message so that it is not happened. Okay, we can check that uh, troubleshooting also, you can do it. Okay, let's verify what is this error. Slash O MK02. This is the vendor, GKPO. Okay, see, this is the, there is a uh, enter part two of Inco terms. Inco terms uh, part two was not provided. Okay, so maybe you can just cash on delivery. The details are missing. That's why system failed to update the purchase group. Okay, that's what happened. Now we just maintain that mandatory field, which was happened. Okay, now we can run again. You will see that. Okay, the same thing. Now save it. So when you're getting any kind of errors, what is the exact error? You can do the troubleshooting and update it. See, now both have changed. Let us verify the same. Now 
where is the purchasing okay you can check directly the purchasing data no need to verify all the information come down see the purchasing group 001 is updated the same is happened for other vendor also okay 5012 it would be happened the same thing based down see purchasing group is updated it will be useful for you to update a single value for multiple vendors at the same time you can use this xk99 or this mask approach both are uh, same uh, table okay you can just go to the same program only uh, you can follow and you can update it i hope this video is helpful for you to guide your users when you want to replace a certain value for multiple vendors thanks for watching if you like the video hit like button to encourage me and share our videos with your recipe friends to make use of our huge number of videos currently we have 262 videos on our channel and keep sharing and keep helping people keep growing thank you